All right, happy Friday. It's a little late, but hey, we're getting her done. All right, I got three beers. I got Indiana Amber. Buddy Brandon got me this one to try. And then Tyler brought me in uh, Three Floyds makes this. I think this is who makes zombie dust. It's a Necron 99. I'm probably saying it fucking wrong, but I have no idea what to expect from that. And then Shipyard Brewing Company got pumpkin head so it's supposed to taste like pumpkin so and as you know i am an avid coors light drinker and last year they had this deal where on the cases you had these codes on there you could uh, get uh points at the, Bud at the uh, budweiser store the coors light uh store and you could buy you know uh shirts and hats and all kinds of shit. Well, I kind of waited before I tried to cash my points in, and uh, I got, um, I forget how many thousands of points I had. Some of them you could, like, uh, almost use them to bid on, like, a, a Super Bowl trip or whatever. But uh, I did buy one item. I thought, well, buy me this Coors Light hat. You know, that's pretty cool. So, uh, I get it, and uh, this is this fabulous hat that I bought with I don't know how many points but I figured out this pack probably cost me about $250 of beer to get it and um craftsmanship on this hat this hat is like second to none I mean I mean who would not want to go out wearing this fucker I mean seriously this has got to be the shittiest fucking hat I've ever ever seen I this is like a $2 painter's hat that you get at Porter Paints to paint your fucking house with. I mean, for one, a fucking flat bill, that's, to me, that's like the modern day dunce cap. I mean, give me a fucking break. Yeah, I just, uh, going through some stuff and I found this and I, uh, it reminded me of that. I thought, the, yeah, what a ripoff. I own tons of hats, ball caps and cowboy hats, whatever, so I'm a hat guy. And I can tell you, that hat fucking sucks. Anyway. Alright, so first we're going to do this uh, uh, Indiana Amber. I have no idea what to think of it. Like I said, IPAs and these weird beers I'm not usually a big fan of, so we'll try them. Oh, wow. That is not good. Here comes that fucking aftertaste. Oh, God, why? Why do you just gotta fuck with beers and make them taste like shit? I mean, it's literally got a fucking angel on the front of it. I mean, how misleading is that? It's got a weird, I mean, it's not terrible, I guess. See, now that I drink it, the more I drink it, it I mean, it's tolerable. I just don't care for the taste. I'll, get, I'll give it about a three and a half. I mean, I can, I'll be able to drink this one. I mean, I won't be pouring, pouring it in the toilet. And if I really do hate a beer, I will pour, pour, I can't even fucking talk. I will pour it in the toilet before I pour it down the sink, just because I kind of get satisfaction out of it. Alright, sorry Brandon. I think you said you didn't care for it either, but I'll give it about a three, three and a half. See, but now I'm getting this fucking aftertaste. Yeah. Alright. We're going to try this. Necron 99. Necron. Necron. What the fuck does that even mean? I mean, he's got like three Floyds. That's who makes it. They always have like really cool graphics for their beer. I'm probably going to drink this out of a out of a thimble or something. Or I got to, you know, pour it into a 
a coffee mug and then swish it around and pour it into, I mean, who knows. Come on. Ugh. I'm not a fan. This shit's probably not cheap. God. That's fucking nasty. I'll give that about a one and a half. Yeah, I won't drink that shit. My God. It's horrible. Ugh. Oh, God. I mean, seriously. I I really like to, I mean, somebody that really likes that, I'd really like to find out why and what kind of normal beer they drink. Like, it's not, I mean, this screams, I drink this because I'm different. That's what, it, that's what this screams. Not because it fucking tastes good. That's not even fucking, that doesn't even taste like beer at all. Like, that's like some kind of a fucking... It's like something somebody left in the fucking refrigerator for six years and you decide to drink it and it's fermented with something. All right, so now I'm not really optimistic about this pumpkin beer. I mean, I do like pumpkin pie. I mean, I don't get into all the fucking crazy pumpkin shit, you know, when the fall comes, but... Let's try another drink of this. God, that shit was nasty. Yeah, it's just, it's got a smooth taste. It's just kind of a, just not something I drink. That just straight up tastes like shit. Like, that's terrible. Terrible. All right. Pumpkin head. Tyler says this shit's really good. Well, we'll see. It does fucking smell like pumpkin. actually pretty good it's a weird flavor to have in a beer but it definitely tastes pretty good yeah I like that I mean it's not something you want to drink all night long but I mean just to have a beer I mean it's got Really good flavor. It doesn't have a shitty fucking aftertaste, that's for sure. Like, seriously, I, I don't get that. I don't get it. Like, it's like it just got shot out of a crackhead's asshole or something. God! Dude, that's fucking horrible. Tyler, you know that, you know that shit tasted like that, right? You had to. Don't tell me you like that. Oh. All right, I'm going to give this. I'm going to give it a six and a half. Six. I'll give it a 6.7. Actually, I actually kind of enjoy this. All right. I got some more. Trying to make these not so damn fucking long, but uh, I get uh, sidetracked in between these, and uh, sometimes there's more time to lapse. I don't get to put them together, but I'm going to try to do three more tonight. Uh, it's getting late, so you're probably not going to see it until Saturday, and I'm planning on doing a lot on Saturday, so <clears throat> excuse me. I mean, I guess I have to belch in every one of these because I can't help it. So if not, we'll see you tomorrow. Good night.